This is Dago Soniga. Welcome again to another episode. And I'm super excited about the topic I'm going to share with you today, and it's about your associations. Does that really make a difference who you associate with and what impact does it have in your life? So stay tuned, and we're going to discuss that in these next few minutes. Stay tuned. All right, well, welcome back. So I want to talk about the topic of who you are, what you're a product of, and if you really start to look at your life and step out for one second, if, if you give me that permission, just for you to step out for one second and look at your life right now, who are you associating with? Who are you spending your time with? What kind of conversations are you having? Who's on your speed dial on your cell phone? And so really, just for one second, for a few minutes, just think about it closely. Who are you right now? Are you that person that, that you envision becoming? And so there's a couple of factors that play in that really make a difference in who you are today and who you're gonna to become tomorrow. And it has to do with these three things that I'm gonna share with you right now. The first one is, very simple, it's a repeat of what I just mentioned, is you are who you hang out with. There's this old saying that if you know nine broke people, chances are you're the 10th broke person. And so it does make a difference. If you want to increase your income, if you want to increase your value, then you need to be around people that are going to challenge you to be better, that are probably at a higher level or playing at a higher level than you. And therefore, just by os osmosis almost, you start to increase and you start to become better. Either that or if, if you're that type of person that is, is positive, that's good, that's always a go-getter, you're going to repel all the negative bad people. It just doesn't mix. It's kind of like mixing oil with water. It doesn't happen. The second factor that plays into who you are is the books you read. Think about that for a second. When was the last time you read a book? And not just a novel or something that's just about random things or I, don't, I shouldn't say that, it shouldn't be about random things, but think about when was the last time you read a book about self-improvement or you becoming better or getting or increasing in, the, in your business or your, your line of work. So you become who you hang out with and the books you read. And then the last one is this. The last one is the events and trainings that you attend. And so those are the three things that make who you are. So make your checklist and start to check those off. Are you hanging out with the right people? Are you training? Are you attending the right events that are putting you out of your comfort zone? Are you reading the books that are improving your mindset, expanding your vision? And so that's the message for today. I hope you got a ton of value out of it. Subscribe below. There's going to be more messages coming just like this. And so we'll see you on the next one.